Well, excuse the pun, but that was Swift. Two weeks after her split from Calvin Harris, it looks like Taylor Swift has a new love story with Tom Hiddleston. Prepare yourself for Hiddle Swift. Okay, it'll take a minute to catch on. It looks like Taylor Swift has moved on from Calvin Harris to another Brit, Tom Hiddleston. You know, the one who just might be the next James Bond. Swift was spotted smooching and cuddling with Hiddleston in Rhode Island, as seen in these photos obtained by UK outlet The Sun. Apparently, the photos were snapped on Tuesday, just two weeks after Swift's split from Scottish DJ Calvin Harris. The breakup appeared amicable until now. Right after the photos surfaced online, Harris and Swift unfollowed each other on Twitter, and Harris deleted his post-breakup tweet about a huge amount of love and respect remaining between the two of them. Harris also reportedly tweeted, then deleted, oh boy, it's about to go down. And that's not all. Both stars have also removed all social media evidence of their 15-month love affair, including photos from their romantic anniversary trip in March. While sources say there was no drama or cheating involved in Harris and Swift's breakup, rumor has it the DJ was blindsided by his ex's budding new romance. As for Taylor and Tom, it seems like the two first hit it off last month when they were spotted busting move together at the Met Gala. As we mentioned, the 35-year-old actor who was last romantically linked to Elizabeth Olsen is rumored to be the frontrunner to become the next Bond. However, he recently said he doesn't, quote, think that announcement is coming. Only time will tell and only time will reveal where Hiddle Swift is headed. Time for two. Ashton Kutcher and Mila Kunis are expecting another baby. The couple's rep confirmed the news. The actors are already parents to Wyatt Isabel, who will turn two in October. Paging all believers, Justin wants your help. The Canuck superstar is campaigning to shut down the website Hollywood Life and to, quote, give them a taste of their own medicine. On Instagram, the Beebs urged his fans to tweet the hashtag Hollywood Life is garbage. This comes after Bieber first called out the site with an Instagram message reading, Hollywood Life is untruthful and hurtful. Let's spam them and petition them to shut down. The gossip site is known for its so-called exclusives and unverified reports, often about Bieber's romantic entanglements. All recent stories about the singer have now been pulled down. Spoiler alert, I'm in the CIA. Are you joking with me right now? Comedy meets action as Kevin Hart and Dwayne The Rock Johnson team up in Central Intelligence. They might look like a mismatched pair, but as TK found out, these two have more similarities than you might think. Tell me about the moment that you two realized um, that you just made the most perfect on-screen couple. I know they had the table read. Oh, yeah. yeah. When we first went to the table read, the first time we read the script, yeah. And we're like, we're sitting next to each other and we're reading, but we're vibing. Every day, by the way, was exactly what you're seeing. I said, you're looking at two guys that enjoy what they do. Yeah. They're silly. There's a great anchor of heart in the movie. No you pun know, intended. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no pun intended. Cool. No. No, it's not cool. Cool. No, I said it's not cool. Central Intelligence hits theaters tomorrow. How are you? Very well, thanks. How are you? I'm fine. Classified. I have a whiskey, please. After a Hollywood hiatus, Renee Zellweger is making perhaps the most anticipated return to the big screen of this year in Bridget Jones's Baby. Also returning for the third film in the beloved British franchise, Colin Firth. Hello Canada caught up with the actor. He told us that he hardly ever re-watches his movies, but he went back and watched the first Bridget Jones movie and he thought it was a fantastic movie and that he really can't wait for, uh, for the third installment. Neither can we. In the meantime, get the full scoop from him in this week's issue of Hello on newsstands and your texture app today. And make note, Wang's World season finale is tonight on Viceland. Don't miss it.